There's less than a week to go until the Day of Hope fundraiser, benefiting local patients at Mission Hope Cancer Center. Dave Alley has a look at the way breast cancer treatment has improved there. So we have the variant system. Radiation oncologist Dr. Ben Wilkinson shows off advanced technology now being used to treat breast cancer at Mission Hope. We use the technology here to accurately target the lymph nodes that are at risk while pulling the dose and the radiation dose away from parts of the body that we don't need to include in the radiation field. Particularly the heart and lung. Especially for left-sided breast cancer, the interaction of a reg regular radiation field with the heart is something that you would normally be concerned with. Making treatment safer and better to state-of-the-art additions. A breath hold technique, which we're able to allow women to take a breath in that moves the chest wall up and away from the heart, as well as the 3D surface mapping that allows us to make sure that once we plan a radiation case, that women are going to be in the exact same position each day for that treatment. Giving patients a higher cure level and added quality of life. Women are going to live a long time and we want them to live free of heart disease and free of any issues with the lung. It's new treatment and equipment just like this that is directly supported through the Day of Hope, showing just how important this fundraiser is. This is a great, a great opportunity in our, our community, in particular Santa Maria here has always been so supportive of, of Mission Hope. Our messages go out there and contribute online whatever way you can. In Santa Maria, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Valley. And the Day of Hope is coming up on Wednesday, August 26th. It starts at 7 in the morning and ends at 2. This year, a special community car parade through Santa Maria begins at 11 a.m.